Now the latest developments on growing tensions with North Korea. Today, Vice President Mike Pence, who's overseas right now, issued a warning to North Korea not to test the resolve of the United States. It comes just one day after North Korea state television aired scenes of a musical marking the birthday of the country's founder. The video ended with a mock-up of missiles engulfing the United States in flames. Hi, witness news analysts. Lieutenant General Reginald Centracchio joins us in studio now. They've had fev uh, several failed attempts at this uh, short-range missile. Now there's talk about long-range missiles. What does that mean, General? It means that they're continuing to develop their missile program. Uh, the failure they had was a, a medium range. Now they're looking to long range, which obviously could hit the United States as well as Hawaii and other areas in the uh, in that range area. So I think what we're looking to is a, a duality between the missile development and a new nuclear warhead to fit those. So a nuclear warhead is possible then? Absolutely. You know, they're testing them, uh, perhaps I would think in the next several days we'll see another test. The idea is to build, build a nuclear weapon head to be able to fit on that weapon that they're developing to deliver it wherever they're going to develop, uh, deliver it. So I think they're, they're looking at a two-fold mission. One is to develop a missile and the other is to develop a warhead that fits that missile. Well, the U.S. is repositioning chips, uh, ships outside of Japan and the Korean Peninsula. What, you know, who is uh, guiding that. Yeah, well, obviously, it's the Secretary of Defense as well as the, the Security Council that advises the President. It's called the Carrier Group, and the Carrier, as well as several other ships to protect that carrier, is repositioning itself within the Sea of Japan as well as around the peninsula of, uh, of uh, Korea uh, for twofold. Well, number one is to make sure we're showing uh, that we have the intent, uh, a show of force, and if we need to act, uh, we will. And two, do we need China's support in all this? Absolutely. You need China. Uh, otherwise, uh, it's a no-game. It's a no All right, General. As always, thank you for your thoughts.